Much to my satisfaction, season two of Mickey Mouse Funhouse has just been uploaded to Disney Plus, or at least the first five episodes. So just as I thought I was done with these reviews, I'm back at them again. And the first episode gets off to a really great start. This is the Enchanted Tea Party. And I have to say this is beautifully animated. Visually, it's absolutely stunning. And it's got a really important message too about the importance of taking turns. The gang are off to the Enchanted Forest, which, as I said, looks absolutely stunning. They're stunning. They're going to be having a tea party with Pinky the Gorilla, who I love. Absolutely adorable character. And when they get there, they decide to split up and find the perfect spot to have their tea party. And Daisy and Goofy both decide that they have found the perfect spot. Daisy's by a waterfall. Goofy's is by a tree. And Mickey says, well, the best thing we can do is take turns and on this occasion we'll have the they also used um this this flower that they spun and whoever the bright petal pointed at it was their turn and i thought that was a, a pretty good idea it's not just one person making the decision they kind of leave it to fate which i think is a good thing that particularly parents of, of young children or anybody watching young children instead of you deciding whose turn it is leave it to fate and then nobody can argue and say that it's not fair or you know, it wasn't fairly decided. It was purely down to chance. And that's what happens here. And Goofy's delighted that it was his turn. But, you know, Mickey and Funny both say, Daisy, you'll have your turn. But as one might expect, Daisy, being quite stubborn, is not pleased with this. She goes off in a huff and decides to wander away because she's annoyed that it's not her turn. And unfortunately, because she's wandered off, she gets lost and the gang have to try and find her. The message there is very obvious. Well, there are two messages. The first is that it's important to take turns and that there are some very clever and creative ways of deciding whose turn it is. The second message is that if it's not your turn, be a gracious loser and don't go wandering off in a mood because you could get lost and that's not very good. I think it's very important for everybody, not just children, to remember that taking turns is important and you're not always going to get things your way. And also, it will be your way another time. So don't worry about it. I thought it was a really good message, a really nice narrative. I did, when I was watching it, I was thinking, you're not having a tea party, you're having a picnic. Because they were carrying picnic baskets and they were outside. But actually, when it came to it, the tea party setting, I thought, was quite nice. And it worked quite well. So in all, this is a pretty strong start to the second season of Funhouse.